In times of crisis, people look to their leaders for answers. But ever since the planets were ripped from our sky, it seems all I can offer are more questions. And now, with Mars returned, I hardly know where to start. Where is she? Your theory was correct. The relic is of the pyramids, there's no doubt. Word is out about Mars. I need more time. The Cabal are mobilizing. We need to... Secure the camp! Seems they have another target. What are they aiming at? Savathun. Guardian? Guardian, do you read me? We're here, Ikora. We're back on Mars. Back? From where? Savathun's throne world. I know we should have checked in, but we had Savathun in our sights. That might have been our only shot at her, and we couldn't miss it. I understand completely. That's not like Savathun to allow herself to be seen so easily. There's something else. Before we left the ship, we ran into one of her knights, and it... It had a ghost, Ikora. Same as any other light bearer. A ghost? A hive knight with a ghost? But that means... Savathun stole the light. But that's impossible, isn't it? Impossible? With Savathun, nothing is impossible. Hive god of cunning and lies. Hive legend tells us she was born on a hostile, far-off planet, where she would have lived a short, uneventful life. If it weren't for the worm familiar that warned of an impending cataclysm. And so, she led her siblings into the depths, where the ancient worm gods offered them immeasurable power in exchange for endless blood tribute. From this, the Hive were born, and countless civilizations were condemned to extinction. For untold ages, they devoured life and light wherever it could be found, facing little resistance, until they tried to take on the Guardians. After the death of her brother Oryx, Savathun went into hiding. Not out of fear, of course, but out of strategy. Because Savathun knows the best way to beat your enemy is to join them. In her greatest trick yet, she infiltrated the vanguard, weakening us from within. And stealing our most sacred resource. The one thing we thought she could never touch. The light.
opened fire on us. My warriors were responding to unexpected threats. Surprised you had any troops left to report the incident. Not sure I'd go in there if I were you. The rules of engagement had changed. I don't need to listen to this. Guardian, what fortuitous timing. Indeed. I'm fresh from performing Cabal funeral rites. Care to explain? Our condolences, Epris. Your people fought and died with honor. But they didn't have to. We can all prevent future losses if we choose to put the incident on Mars behind us and work together. What we discovered there is a threat to both humanity and the Cabal. You want my help. Want is a strong word. You need my help. I don't know how the Hive came into possession of the Light. My core will find out. But in the meantime... Invincibility lies in the defense. The possibility of victory in the attack. Sun Tzu. I've read your texts. You want us to hit them. I need us to hit them. Hard. I will never be the Taken Queen. I refuse to play second fiddle to my brother Oryx. When Oryx carved the Tablets of Ruin, he described the ability to create the Taken. But Oryx's chisel was affected by viral power from the deep. I studied its vermicular path. I read between the lines. The Tablets hide a riddle. The answer to this riddle is something greater than the power to take. It is the power of the witness to move worlds from one reality to another. This is what I will do. I will not take. I will give. I will grant the Traveler a safe haven away from its enemies. And once it hangs in the sky of my throne world, I will seal it away. Ikora, why would you keep this from me? If I had known... I didn't keep anything from you, Zavala. Not intentionally. I couldn't fill you in on every minute detail. When it comes to Savathun, no detail is too small. You know that better than anyone. Which is why I made some judgment calls without you. As you do without me. Not on a matter like this! Ah. Uh, Guardian. We can discuss this more later. My point, Ikora, is that we are meant to be a team. We can't rely on your instincts alone. Perhaps I can't rely on them at all this investigation is going. It's clear my judgment has been compromised. I should step back. Let you and Eris handle this. As a team. Ikora's instincts are the only reason we've come so close to the truth. This new lead puts it firmly within our grasp. All right, then. You and the Guardian follow up. Keep me posted. A trusted source has informed us of new evidence. A memento from Savathun's last known location before her conversion to the Light. It's kept deep within her fortress. A difficult place to reach. But we have no other options. Go there and I'll be in touch. Before it happened.
happened. My own death, brought on by the separation from my power. And in these final moments, I look to the sky. Hello, old friend. I've chased you for a long time. First as an enemy, then as a collector. And finally, now, a supplicant. The Guardians say, devotion inspires bravery. Bravery inspires sacrifice. And sacrifice... that I could forget something like that, isn't it? Such a storied life, erased. The light offers us a fresh start, but if we don't know where we came from, how will we know where to go? I'm so grateful to you for reminding me, for telling my story. Wait. What is she talking about? She remembers. We helped her remember. Thanks for the memories, Guardian. We have to leave. So, you're saying Savathun was dead? Our most devious adversary, the one who nearly decimated the last city from within, was dead. And the Traveler resurrected her? I wouldn't have believed it either, but... But why would she need us to recover her memories if she never lost them in the first place? This has to be another trick. A lie to fool us into surrendering the Traveler without a fight. This has been the Traveler's approach from the beginning. The Books of Sorrow detail many civilizations it blessed with the Light, then abandoned. High propaganda. The Fallen tell the same story. When the Witness and its Black Fleet came to call, the Traveler moved on to our system. For it sacrificed itself to save humanity from the same forces. Forces which included the Hive! 
After all that, why would the Traveler give our worst enemy the light? It doesn't matter. I don't know why the Traveler gave Sabathun the light. Maybe it has changed its mind about Guardians. Maybe it's not as infallible as we once believed. I don't know, and it doesn't matter. Because I'm here to protect humanity. And if Savathun takes the Traveler, we lose our light. Along with any hope for surviving the Witness's return. So, whatever it takes to stop this heist, we will do. All right. How do we stop this? I'm not sure yet. But I know where to find out. soon be claimed by the light. Unless we claim them first, we will tell the most cunning sibling of a cataclysm. A prophecy of great loss. We will feed her fear, her pride. We will say, young Sathona, the end is coming. Great cataclysm. A god wave. In the sky, there is only death. But salvation lies in the deep. Lead your sisters down. Your coming will spare their short lives. And you will be reborn. The Witch Queen. Sabathun. Tricked. The hive would lie to. Little ghost, you were asked to accept the darkness. Asked to turn against your cousins. Asked to defy the will of the traveler. My ghosts make no concessions. We serve the traveler's true interests. No concessions? How stupid do you think I am? You and your siblings, you killed my friends! I remember Crota and the Great Disaster. I remember Oryx and the Taken. I'll never forget what happened to Zagira, to Osiris. I would die before I ever chose to help the Hive. Isn't this interesting? I miscalculated. So did you, Guardian. So protective of your traveler, that you wouldn't let me keep it safe. But the witness is coming. The game is yours to play now. Yours to win. 
or lose. Just don't say, I didn't warn you. Where did your ghost go? Guardian, I just got the message. The Traveler is back in the last city. Is it done? Is Salvathun... She's dead. But her ghost got away. Good enough. Hold your position. The Hidden are coming to secure the remains. Good work, Guardian. You did the right thing. Now what? Now, we prepare for the witness and stop the next collapse. The very parasite that once plagued the Witch Queen herself. Queen Mara, good to see you. Do not delay us with pleasantries. This parasite knocks at death's door. What use do we have for Savathun's dying worm? This parasite is an opportunity to learn from humanity's greatest failure. Our collapse. But not ours alone. That day was as much a failure for the wit. Are you okay? I'm fine. As I said, our collapse was as much a failure for the witness and its followers. Savathun included. Savathun was there? On behalf of the witness. But something prevented humanity's end. Something known by Savathun and... Her worm. It requires strength and a new host to survive, to divulge its secrets. But that's a death sentence. For most, yes. But for the Queen of the Awoken? It's worth the risk. <laughs> <laughs> 